So, hello guys, and we're back to the course of Make Hold a Crate. So, can you see this blank screen here? So, we're gonna, and we're gonna do arcade.makeo.com. That's a pretty great. So, as you can see, do you know what we're gonna do today? We're gonna make this thing. We just call it maze. No, no, no. I'll try again. And as you can see, you have only six, five, four, three, two, one. Yay, I win before the time's in. We'll be like that. So, so, uh, let's go to tutorials. And you can see the last one here. Have a maze. So, let's see if we click. So, we'll start tutorial. And let's make some. Maze. Let's see what they want us to do. So, they, they want us to set our spread. And our spread is going to be, it's going to be this little pointy thing. To put it there. And next, we'll next. And they want us to draw it, but we wanted this one. Oh, I think this one. I'm gonna change it a bit. I don't think he's look better, but it's okay. Oh, wow, like a ghost. That's look like a ghost. So let's go next. Move my sprite with buttons for 100. And next, they want us to create time map. So set time map. So all we need to do is, I think we'll go to the dungeons, and then I'm gonna get the diamonds. Okay. So. I'm gonna start from here. Okay. I think line could be better. Then So, this maze look pretty great. That's look pretty great. And we're gonna use this thing to cover it. And this entire thing more. Cover with this. That's the great. And let's see, we need some walls. We're also gonna put things here so we can make a place. And and we'll let's start from here. So we're gonna use the walls. You want us to make a thumb map with walls on it. So, so we can uh, make it a maze. And I'm gonna erase the wall of this one. And let's done. Next they want us to uh, Oh, that's so great. So next, place on top of random. 
So we wanted to place on top of random this one. Let's see. So there it is. And as you cannot see, because you need to camera for all sprites here. And now, let, let's see what we have here. But we cannot do wind it because we didn't put an overlap thing. So let's go back to the same place. And then they want us to let do want us to make an overlap thing. So if overlap at location uh, hmm. Okay, this treasure box here? I mean This treasure box that we got here, this treasure box. An overlap at location here, then they want us to game over loose when with smell effects. And let's try it guys, but we're not done for the tutorial. Let's see. Next, they want us to start countdown. That's look great. Ten times. Not yet. So next, let's see. Wow, that's a great one. So let's okay, and then we'll finish it. But we don't want to publish. Well. That's a very big code. No, 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 no. Don't hit me, okay? No, don't game over loose. No, no, no. Four, three, two, one. So, yes. Oh, whoa. One, one, one. Wow. I almost didn't lose. I mean, I almost didn't win. So, so, the thing is, uh, we're gonna make my titles, which is uh, gonna be a lava, so we can make some ob obstacle and put some a little bit hazard lava. So we're done for it, and we're gonna put some somewhere. And put it around, around here. That's look pretty great. And for another one, I'm gonna put it like here. And we're gonna duplicate another overlap, which is gonna be lava. And game over loose with a solve effect. Oh, that's so... No, no, no. That's no card. <laughs> oh, man. Never thought that. Wow, that's almost zero. So, so, what about a music melody that can uh, make it more greater? So, at the melody, then we're gonna format the code, and that melody will be. So great, I like it. Let's try. Wow, that's 
that's a great ending. So, as you can see, we got a great thing here. So, all we need to do is uh, add this start countdown. We're gonna make a verbal. So, we're gonna make a verbal, call it countdown, to keep the value, to keep the value of the countdown. Countdown. No, countdown. Uh, we'll set countdown to 10 first, and then we'll get the on start up. And then at the variables, we'll get the countdown to put it here. It will be the same. Oh man. Oh, what about a little bit screen shake? Yes. The screen shake. So we're gonna get the screen shake here by uh, three, two pixels. Four, five, six. So that's look pretty great. And do you know that you can make a function of a countdown? Yep, so we're gonna try making a function that that can make a countdown. But just for nothing, I'm just gonna show you that how to make it. So all you need to do is we're gonna start countdown. And then we're gonna get a number. We're gonna call this town down. Wait a minute. Town down number. So we're gonna done for it. And then we're gonna put a countdown here, and we're gonna use countdown number. And this thing we don't need it yet. So next, if you wanna get the countdown thing, you could get start down countdown to here, and then change it to ten, and means that you could use that countdown variable to put it there and then it'll be the same that's so great I'm just showing you okay I'm just showing you yep I'm just uh, showing you so You could use a uh, like uh, some splash. And the first time you wanted to splash base. Wait a minute. No, that's not like what we wanted. We wanted show long text. So we're gonna put it here. Show long set at center. We're gonna call it uh, go to winner in 
in a uh, ten minute. In ten minutes. That's a great. So at the center. Go to the winner in ten minutes. So now we make just this and that's look great. So it could be great. So now that we got our thing means that I'm gonna try play it for you. Maybe I don't let the sound. There'll be no sound if I unmute the sound. If I mute the sound. Yes. So I'm gonna try again. I'm gonna take a picture and let's download to our meal it. So you got a USB cable here and I'm gonna plug it. So I'm gonna plug it this way and then and then open it. So next I'm gonna download here in Neobit. So we'll go in the files and then I'm gonna go to my uh, arcade for no downloads. So let's see if this one is nice. Now that you uh, copy it, we're gonna put it into the arcade for that we're gonna simply open it. So it'll be our crate for here and we'll uh, place it. How clayton and we got our game inside it. So we're gonna take the USB cable out and then delete all these. And that's look great. So this one I'm also gonna stop it a bit. No, this one no doesn't matter. So I'm gonna go to the show hardware and I'm gonna play it for ya. Oh uh, so I'm gonna play by myself. And that's look pretty great. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoy. Make code our pray. May.